Hi everyone! Hello. Welcome back to Bailey's Homestead. For those of you that are new around here, my name is Danny. And I'm Will. And our homestead here is named after our little dog Bailey, who is off on an adventure at the moment. <laughs> We have 16 acres here in northern Portugal. We've got the house to renovate here and we've been making a start on the land. Yes. We are completely off grid here. And this summer we're trying to grow as much of our own food as possible. Which is super exciting. Yep. For those of you that are rejoining our channel, thank you so much for tuning back in. We really do appreciate it. We want to say a big massive thank you for all your support and an extra thank you to those of you that contributed to helping us get back on our feet. That's uh, Perius, Reynold, Kindle, Dion and Julie. So thank you so much. Thank you very much. Yeah, Great we can't helps. tell you how much it means to us. Mm -hmm. So first video back, we will show you what we've been up to the past few weeks. It's been pretty busy. We have been. Uh, yeah, it's big yeah. exciting things happening. Enjoy the vid. And here she comes. Here she comes. Eventually, she shows up now. Now she shows up. Where are you? Come on. Hey. So this is Billy. That's the one. She's the one. Is this your homestead? She loves her crazy life, as you can see. <laughs> In the thorns again. Dee, 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 dee. It's a beautiful day in Portugal. Not, not such a beautiful noise being made by my husband. You a bit hot, Bailey?
I drill them, you can screw them. Just need to get the seeds in now. Today I am going to get some seeds into this bed here. Got cucumber for one side with the trellis for support and eggplant or aubergine for the other side. Uh, I've also got some rocket and I want to put some red onions in here because we have lots of onion seeds started and they're they're a good size but we're running out of space to put them so we're adding them into quite a few of the beds. You can get quite a lot of uh, fruit vegetables from things like courgettes, aubergine, and cucumber seeds. So I'm just going to put three in tonight. Either side, in here and in here, I'm just going to put some rocket just to leave the space for something. I have successfully grown rocket before, quite an easy thing to grow, so good gap filler, I think.
left today is water, water the seat in. We have this makeshift hose set up from the little stream we have running through the property. This is the water coming from the water mine that will, will in the future fill the pond. Well, we do plan to set up a better water system. Just haven't got to it yet. <laughs> but this works for now. Hot day and little beals. Are you lying in the stream? Are you lying in there? <laughs> hey, come here, Bailey. What are you doing in there? Nice and cold? Oh, you're soaking wet. Our very first orange. orange. I mean, we bought the tree with the orange on it, but. But the tree's doing well. It is doing well. Looks good. Let's see her. Hee <laughs> Juicy! Mm. Nice oranges. At the moment we are just taking the very long walk down into Amaranth to the garage to pick up our car which is broken. Yeah, hopefully it will be fixed. Again. Again. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like story of our lives. Nothing major wrong with it but unfortunately the window wipers didn't work or stopped working um, which you uh, Kind of need. Kind of need, especially if there's a sudden downpour of rain. <laughs> 100%. So we're just taking the walk down. It's about six and a half miles. So, and it's all quite downhill, but some, it's a really nice day. And, and it's a nice walk. It's a really nice walk, sort of through the, the village, just below us. So many great finds. Yesterday I moved this tap, it was just over there, but that seemed to be at the bottom of the driveway, so I didn't really want it there. Um, it was held up with, with just a metal pole hammered in and a few cable ties. So I'm going to make something a little bit more permanent. I don't think it will be moved again from here, so... This tap comes off the main water pipe, 
that feeds everything to our house. So it's also as well as it being just an extra tap a bit further away from the house, we also use it to get any air locks sorted out, so any air that's trapped in the pipes, we can get it all out through this tap. So find a few bits of pallet wood which I'm going to make a little box for it. There we have it. Another re job done. The only thing left to do now is try and twist the tab around so the face is down. instead of sideways and fill this trench in I had to dig up a bit more than I wanted but this connection is where the top was as you can see it's just at the bottom of our drive so good to get it moved and out of the way and a bit more permanent. That's now the trench all filled in. Good to have another job done. And to be on your way back to sleep again. Nope, still awake. Yeah. Good girl. Belly rubs. I'm just getting a few more posts together for some extra garden beds that we're adding in today. I have well, quite a lot of trees around the place that kind of need thinned out to give some space to grow, which uh, and this is a really good use for the wood from that. So. Yeah, I need 12 posts all together. I think this is poplar wood. So I've cut them to size and I'm just gonna put a point on the end of each one. So that will go into the ground a bit easier. It looks like the sun has decided to show its face, which is excellent. You would think it's the hard winter because I've got my hat and I'm wrapped up like a snowman but it is actually really cold. One day it was hot and the next day it's cold so just the time of the year I suppose, four seasons in a day.
Getting another garden bed in. It really is a four seasons in a day kind of day, isn't it? It is. <laughs> Little Bailey has the right idea. She's just tucked up. Oh, darling. It's day to be inside, isn't it? She won't sit inside unless we're sat inside, though. <laughs> Pretty grey, but look, you can see it from here. Two more beds in the garden. It was pretty speedy, I would say. Good teamwork, husbando. Good teamwork. <laughs>
There's the organ. <laughs> no, I think this is the organ. Hey puppy. <laughs> hey puppy. Hey cheeky boy. Hey cheeky boy. Still eating the chocolates. <laughs> it's so good. Chocolate covered almonds. Um, thanks everybody for watching this week's video. We will be back next Sunday at the same time, so please do tune in then. If you haven't been hit subscribe already, please do so. It really helps us out. And leave us a comment uh, as we love to hear from you as well. Well, we'll see you next week. <laughs> Billy's enjoying the wood burner being lit, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Cozy spot. Yeah.